tell us about what's going on in Derby yes. at the moment. Yes, so this is on the front of the uh, Telegraph Sport pullout and a story by John Percy. Wayne Rooney is under further scrutiny at Derby after it emerged. He was responsible for an injury which is sidelined him midfield adjacent night for up to 12 weeks. Rooney went in for a challenge on night during a training game that has left the Republic of Ireland International with an ankle injury which threatens to rule him out for at least two months of the uh, Championship Club season. The incident occurred at Penny Hill Park, the luxury hotel in Spa and Surrey, where Derby stayed recently for pre-season training camp. And Rooney had to take part in training to make up um, because of the lack of players. They've only got nine registered senior players at the moment. Quite incredible when you think how, really. how soon the season is. Two of those are goalkeepers, by the way. Six week, isn't it? Um, yeah, it's the week Friday, week, isn't it? Yeah. So he is... Um, it's understood that Rooney's challenge with Knight was 50-50 in accident, but uh, the 20-year-old academy product is now facing an extended um, spell out on the sidelines. Firstly, the situation at Derby, I mean, so awful, absolutely incredible. But, Ray, have you, uh, have you seen or, or been involved in any, well, any similar happen. incidents in training? No, it does happen. You it's know, Arsene you, Wenger two-footed you. It, it, it's just, <laughs> Colour <laughs> toys two-footed him. Yeah. 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 <laughs> was, that, um, was that on his first day of training? Yeah, yeah. He'd done Patrick Vieira. No, he'd done a Dennis Burkamp, Thierry Henry and, and On his and first Bingo. day? <laughs> yeah. So he tried to make a real... A trial. A trial. And it must have worked, well, must have well, been good they challenges. Him. Yeah. He was a very good, good little player, Colo. Um, I think when it, when you want competitive football, though. I mean, when you're training, I know it's not like as you're playing against your opposition and you're still training together, but you're still competitive. So you're going to get injuries. You're going to get um, people getting banged on their ankles and stuff like that. Um, you hope it doesn't happen, but you are a little bit slower. I think Wayne Rooney's not the quickest <laughs> that he used to be. And he might have been genuinely going for a ball <laughs> that he's a bit late. And you know he's injured the player. I know he's a manager, and he'd, he'd probably be saying, "I'm oh, so sorry about that," and whatever, we'll whatever. <laughs> and he's probably thinking to himself, "Well, oh, I've lost another player, so he's <laughs> yeah, not too happy as well." Yeah, yeah. But it's... yeah, I mean, it's hard to go into a training session and say, "Well, watch, yeah, don't go into because you want it trying to be, you want it to be quite mm. like a game, if you know what I mean. Mm. Especially if it's a practice game or the training sessions you're doing, you don't just want to go through the motions and not not treat it like a game situation." So you're always going to get a few injuries here and there. Hamstring pulls, calf strains, you know, it's part and parcel of the game, I'm afraid. Not ideal timing Not ideal, by though. any stretch of the imagination. <laughs> um, Sam, thank you very Thanks, much. Thanks, guys. See you again in a bit. Uh, that is Sam Ellard, our reporter. Talk Sport Breakfast with Laura Woods. Monday to Wednesday morning, 6 till 10. On AM, on DAB, via the Talk Sport app and on your smart speaker. Talk Sport.